oracle journeys, there are a lot of different elements within them. So first, it allows more of a personalization of the user experience. And with journeys, you can um, really unpack and pinpoint exactly the population you're trying to target. Within journeys, there are eligibility profiles. So you can create journeys that are specifically for faculty, specifically for staff. You can even do those and break that down even further for faculty with benefits and faculty without benefits. Also, what I learned and what the benefit of using Journeys is, is you can apply sort of an onboarding checklist to your entire enterprise. You don't have to start doing anything now by person by person. You can automatically enroll that checklist through a transaction action. So as soon as someone goes in and adds a pending worker, a journey can be kicked off so that they can start their onboarding experience and that you don't have additional steps from the HR point of view that you have to go in and manually do. Journeys, you can have that experience in well beyond Oracle. A lot of the journeys now within the complex tasks, you can outlink to third parties. So if you aren't using specifically like the benefits module, in that employee onboarding experience, you can link out to a different third party user and the end user themselves believes that it's all still within Oracle. So you have them again, completing those complex transactions, providing guidance and having them complete those steps without ever needing to contact your HR office.